Hello. Today we're going to be exploring making a three-way mitered corner with SolidWorks weld mitts. Have you ever been trying to apply a structural member to something in SolidWorks and wanted it to join together in a way that trims all three pieces equally? Well, you might have found that hard to do. Let me just set this up. Now, to make a leg for this, let's pretend I'm drawing a quarter of a stand right now. And I want to have it so that this leg has a, a three-way miter like this trim. Well, you have to make a new group to make the leg piece. Sometimes it takes me a couple shots at that. There you go. You'll see it by default doesn't trim it the way that I would want it. And if I click my corner treatment option, we have miter selected, but it's not giving us that option. The way that you trick this out, you have to change the trim order of group two or whichever thing you want to do a equal miter to, to trim order one to match the rest of the items. And when we hit enter here, you'll see even in the preview, now we have a three-way miter at this corner and if I wanted to finish this stand off I could do something like mirroring bodies and maybe we can even get all of this little square stand in one go something like this and then I could combine bodies to finish this off so I could hot tip if you use the s key shortcut it has a search bar in it you can search for any of the commands that you would want to use and if you want to use it a lot you can click it and drag it and add it to this shortcut menu so every time you open that up it's an option I'm going to combine these combine these combine these and now we have a nice little frame maybe it needed to be super strong and that's why we did this miter thank you for watching have a nice day